morning YouTube today is August 14th and guess what it's Friday so currently it's about 7 30 um, on my way to work getting ready for work rather and going to go to work and then I have to go get a backpack because I definitely need one as far as um you know my whole workout thing I get tired of carrying around in like a little tote bag so I'm gonna go and look for a book bag a backpack today and Run a couple errands and do some stuff. Because, I mean, it's Friday. Happy Friday, guys. Um, yeah, it's Friday. I'm so excited, happy, thank God. <laughs> so, I'll see you in a bit. So, sometimes I had those moments to where it's the... I love when I wear my weeds. I wear them in a natural state. But sometimes I have these moments where so I want to wear them straight. So, actually, I just started. I just finished straightening my hair. And um, in the morning, it's like a morning ritual um of me listening to elvis duran in the morning show and when i say i burned the crap out of my edges laughing at them because like if you guys haven't heard um it's an app uh on it's an app basically iHeartRadio, radio and we have a whole bunch of like different radio stations artist stations and also like it's really cool um you can create your own app and everything like that so like in the morning i guess to get myself going um i do listen to elvis the it's like my morning ritual and oh my god those guys are hilarious so i just burnt my edges and it hurt so bad <laughs> I guess it was my fault, my stupidity, but I mean, it, it is what it is, but I'm almost ready, so I'll see you guys. So I finally left out, um, running a little, no, not even a little, a lot behind schedule. Um, hopefully I make it work on time, I gotta be there at 9.30, it's not, it's 8.45 now. I'm like, 15 minutes late, leaving our house. So hopefully I make it on time, I think I will. Usually this bus doesn't come till later on so yeah the worst case scenario just get it over see you guys in the fit so i officially have made it through my work day i am so excited off for the weekend and have to go have some fun rather take care of some business as far as getting me a book bag i need one like yesterday go downtown and grab a book bag or try to look for a book bag at least so I'm like that because I'm starting to get tired, tired of carrying around purses. Headed downtown um, on my way to Marshalls to see if I can find a decent backpack. Um, first one, one didn't have anything. Well, what they had was they didn't have anything. <laughs> um, kind of wish that Chris was down here with me because it's kind of like really, really jumping down here. I forgot how nice and how loud it can be on Friday nights. So I'm just gonna, even if I don't find a backpack, I'm gonna, you know, stay just for the ambiance and hang out and yeah, just chill. Really, <laughs> it's really nice outside. It's not too hot. It's not cold. It's like that weather right before fall hits. It's not humid. It's like a nice little breeze out. I'm loving it. So. We're going to be down here for a little while, so yeah, I'm going to enjoy the atmosphere and the weather. Okay. So, we're going to see if I see anything that I like. Hopefully, I do, so this can be kind of like a one-stop thing, and I don't have to shop around for five million things, because I hate, I love shopping, but I hate shopping for specific things that I'm looking for. I can't stand it, right? I can't. So, hopefully, they have what I'm looking for. exactly have what I wanted so I've kind of switched gears now as you can see I'm in the home area um I guess to browse around to see if I see anything that can be useful for me for, well for the apartment so I'm seeing this mug thing super cute I like I have a thing about mugs I really don't you know I guess like in my old age and starting this one like 399 my old age, I'm starting to get like my mom. Um, starting to really have the thing for mugs and tea and all this stuff like that. So, just looking around, not really BSing. 
with like these two little candles and oh my god they smell like oh, god, they smell so good. I have a thing for like candles and incense and everything like I'm kind of like a hippie so to speak so um brought some candles I needed some anyway for the bathroom and for our bedroom and yeah I'm just browsing around, burning some more time. This was, I have to say, this was really by far a really good idea to, you know, just come down here and relax, unwind. I mean, it's one thing, you know, to unwind when you're at home, but it's another thing to unwind, you know, when you're to yourself. You know, there's nothing wrong with going home with someone. I love going home with my boyfriend, but it's something, there's something about, you know, just having that peace of mind by yourself and, you know, just having your thoughts, well, that's really cute, having your thoughts to yourself, and that's kind of why I decided to come down here. Um, you know, just a little food for thought, you know, if you ever, you know, it's always great to come home to someone, but if you can always get that time alone by yourself in your quote-unquote quiet place, then definitely do that. This is kind of sort of my quiet place. I'll show you guys my real quiet place. Just leaving Marshalls. Um, <laughs> it was so funny that um, I kind of had like a brief conversation with one of the cashiers there for like literally two seconds. He asked me, "Did you, man? Did you find everything you need?" And I was like, "I never find everything I need." So he like laughed and everything like that. I guess he was having a bad day because he said, you know. That was kind of, that was a, I'm glad that you came in and because that really did make my day. I was really having a bad day. This is the first time I laughed all day. Something to that effect. But either way, he said, I made him laugh. He needed a good laugh. I think the thing that kind of, I guess, gives me some type of fulfillment is helping people and making people laugh. You know, making people feel good about themselves. You know, making people feel good about their situation. That's kind of, sort of, why I started doing this vlog. One of those things or whatever, I know when I look at blog, vlogs that I had this kind of sense of, oh, that was that was really nice. I really like it. And it kind of sometimes, something that they say or something that they do, it kind of like, in a way, makes my day. So, essentially, I like making people feel good. I like to get relaxed, so this is how I do it. I finally made it home. Um, so this is where I think I'm going to call it a night. It's going on 11 o'clock now. Um, I left downtown about 10.45-ish. Um, no. Probably about, anyway, it's around 11 o'clock. I don't remember when I left. But I know I left. So it's around 11 o'clock. I know I have to get up early tomorrow. Um, stay tuned. Tomorrow I will be vlogging Saturday August, yeah, August 15th. I'll be vlogging. Me and Chris are going to go hang out for a little bit. Then we're going to meet up with my stepdad and my mom and have some crabs. Crabs are like one of the things in Baltimore that, you know, that's like, mwah, we just can't get enough of crabs. So anyway, until next time, we'll let's see you until tomorrow. I will see you guys in the next vlog. And if you like what you saw today, please like, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends. Tell your friends to tell their friends. And... Yeah, we're going to try to keep up the momentum as far as these vlogs are coming. Try to do them on a weekly basis as far as weekends. My weekends are more so busy and more, I'm going to say more fun. More so fun on the weekends. This It's like more so business during the week. I don't really do too much during the weekday because I'm tired. I right, work and all that good stuff. But nonetheless... Like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, tell your friends, tell their friends, and tell their friends, tell some more friends. This has been Whitney, my vlogs, my hometown, welcome to my hometown, rather, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.